Hello, and welcome back to the randomizer. I have decided to press on because I did save on floor two in a hotel. So if my party does get wiped out, then there is, there is an ATM there. So when I make my way back here, I will go through a hospital and I can revive people there. So no reason to backtrack all the way to one of the sanctuary spots. This thing might not attack me, I'm not actually sure. Okay. Oh no! Ness is just a pile of ashes. I guess that's what happens when a zombie dies. Well, Mario and... Question mark. Well, question mark's out of magic. Now I wish I didn't get rid of that bottle of water. That would give me at least a few magic points. I might try to run. Running is an option. I have not exercised that option. Chunky cuneiform. Okay, that's not bad. Not too bad. The run, the run odds in this game... Ow. Did that kill Mario? <sighs> now Mar Mar Mario just sneezed himself to, dead, to death. Awesome. Thank God. Alright, these better be the best treasure chests in the world. Awesome. I've never controlled a living question mark before. Okay, I'll worry about the hard hat when I have a party that's not ashes and ghosts. The thing that sucks about this is even if I wanted to take an intentional death, question mark has so many hit points. It would probably take a while. Well, maybe not with that kind of damage. Okay. So that was a strategic party wipe. I tell myself. How much money do I have in the bank? I hope it's a lot. Okay. That's pretty good. I don't know how much it'll cost to bring everyone back. I don't think it would be more than a hundred per person. Honestly, it's so rare that I engage with the hospital that, uh, that I forget how much it actually costs. And now to find my way back there. I did have a look at the video footage with the hint shop again, 
the next boss I fight will be... Uh... <laughs> something. It wasn't something that, that I was super worried by. Hypnosis Omega. That's cool. That's like a, a sleep spell for an entire group of enemies. Robo Pump, right. Yeah, the Robo Pump can be nasty, but it is, it is just a normal enemy as opposed to a boss enemy. The security robot was sort of like a, a mini boss, almost. Like it's it's a scripted fight, and it is challenging. Oh man, flimsy stinkhorn. Well, I don't want to get mushroomized. And I have one MP. Nope. I was going to attack the mushroom, but my A button stuck. Okay, you can call all, all the armored ants you want. Well, this will give Ness a chance to catch up a little bit on experience. I'm sorry, Armored Ant Horn. Or maybe Ant Thorn. Here we go. Oh, it is more than 100 per party member. Oh, that sucks. Okay, so so I guess it's ten times their current level. No? Because they're level 18 and, and 21. It might be a fixed amount. Alright, well question question mark can take a break. He's several levels ahead of of Ness and Monty, and he's not a very useful character without MP. If I can find someone to sell that chicken to, then I'll have enough to revive question mark. Oh, hi. Auto kill? Thank you. That's very kind of you. Or if I find another ATM, of course. Oh, uh, this is the Tenda underground village. There is an ATM and a phone here, I think? Yeah, that's the phone. Is this an ATM? Is that an ATM? Are you an ATM? No, it's, it's weird junk. There is, like, a resting spot, but it's through that door. Oh wait, there's a, uh, hot springs. It doesn't revive people, does it? It would be nice if it did. Resting well when the hot spring healed you. It does! Okay, awesome. Perfect. I will now... Not a real treasure chest, right? It is. Mr. Baseball Cap. Great. Alright, well... It is time to save my game. Oh, that's cute. Ness calls his mom and she like, she pretends to be 
like a, a busy signal. Yeah, I'm doing okay. After that bath, I feel like a million bucks. Bye. So this is the other direction. In floor two, that I never went. So... Let's, uh, let's see what this way has to offer. Especially with, like, a full revive spot right there. Sandlot Bat. I forget if that's better than what Ness has. Ness needs to sell some of this junk. I'll set, I'll set this chicken free. I, I don't need $110 at this point. Bye, chicken. Enjoy your new life in, the, in this weird cave. Oh yeah, I, I found a hard hat. I think I will give that to Mario, who assuredly still needs the defense. I get. I don't know how I gave that to question mark, but I was very confused for a moment. Yeah, that's not better. Also, I remembered, or half remembered, something about uh having a high guts stat, increasing your odds of hitting. So if I find something that can increase Ness's gut guts a lot, it might be worth uh. Going back to the Casey Bat, but for now, Big League Bat is is my best option. All right. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do something about this controller. I don't know what. All right, five additional defense for Mario. Still lagging behind Ness and Monty, but every little bit helps. The hint man had to go. What if I do need to use the bathroom? Then what, huh? Eh, it's just a UFO. It's just a UFO and a plant. Ow. I don't like when it fires the beam. I like more when it hesitates. Oh, Ness is out of magic points. I guess the hot spring doesn't recover that? So if I had a signed banana... I could give it to this question mark, and this would open up a shortcut. Which I have... the king banana? Oh, I do have the sign banana. Yeah, so he asks about famous stars. So in regular Earthbound, this guy asks you to get a get something signed by by Venus, the pop star, and the thing that you can have her sign is the banana. Yep, there we go. I, I forgot you have to use it as an item. I thought it would automatically give it to him in the dialogue. Huge monster rat.
question mark evolved into fish man so this takes me back to the what is love level which i found a shortcut to earlier in the game the music continues until i go to another room okay well that's that'll be an option later See if there's anything else worth exploring here in the Tenda village. Oh, so so this exit is blocked off. That's right. So I need to find the the book to make the Tenda people less shy. It's uh, overcoming shyness is the title of the book, and then they'll help me help me move that rock to get to Dinosaur Land. And I don't have the book. This Tenda will trade you... Well... After it overcomes its shyness, it will trade you something. For... for tr Trade you items for something, I forget what. I think, I think it wants Horns of Life, which is a very expensive item. Wow, this takes a really long time. Am I supposed to stand still? Oh, I guess I am. For some reason, I thought you had to move in the hot spring to get the healing effect. Yeah, that does not restore magic points. Which is unfortunate. Pretty sure I, I fully explored that cave area. Alright, well, I, I'm done done with this level for now, I think. Never mind. I have to beat up this office. Although, when it revived question mark, it gave him his magic points back. Or them. Or her. All right, back to level three. Now, now that I'm done with that little detour. Oh, this lady wants to fight. Okay, I'll fight you, lady. Brad's your wife. I feel bad about that description. Oh, she's normal now. No longer fragile. And possibly also divorced? Is, is that the state of normalcy for a fragile wife? A strong single woman? I hope so. Ooh, we get reverb in this fight because of this music. Mirror. A beam that causes nighttime stuffiness. Oh. <gasps> Question mark is an ultra hesitating UFO, A. Eh? I don't think they'll get a chance to fire a beam. Well, maybe. One hit point of damage. Nice. So, yeah, turning into the monster doesn't necessarily give you the monster's stats. Which means it is not necessarily useful. Oh, I guess Mario got over his cold. That's cool.
Well, I know the robot can be easily taken out by a freeze spell, so let's have everyone else gang up on the ultra hesitating UFO and question mark can cast a freeze beta on the fictional spin droid. Nice! It missed me. Aw, I missed it. Actually, an alpha probably would have been fine there. Oh nice, I can avoid the bats now. Can I avoid the bear and, and the ghosts? Excellent. That robot is gone forever now, right? Yeah. And yeah, it was just the treasure, nothing else. And I think the treasure was like... A baseball cap? Kind of a waste of a guard robot. So this this hieroglyph or the the cuneiform is oh no it's gone I thought for sure it, those things come back but but I guess not well now that I have a full party I can properly explore level three very exciting want to fight some bugs. And some worthless trash. Uh, let's have everyone gang up on the trash can. And let's have Monty cast fire on the weevils. I think that was effective. Well, I might not have had the chance to try fire on them because... Ness and Mario are beasts. Pretty crummy level. Alright, the cultist is afraid of me. Oh, that that bug was was bold. That's a bold weevil. Get it. Uh everyone gang up on I don't know. Just, just attack whatever, and question mark you can... Question mark is going first, uh, so it might actually be worth it to use Thunder more. I'm not sure. Well, Thunder Alpha, maybe not. Thunder Beta might have hit something, but... The thing about Thunder is that it does, like, there's no defense against it. It's always 100% damage, unlike Fire and Freeze. But with the random targeting, it is not as useful, to say the least. It, it, it's very useful in a fight with a lot of enemies, but you don't get too many of those. Monty had kind of an underwhelming level. Oh! Butterfly. Nice. Ness can get some magic back. Twenty. Is this the library? Or City Hall? It's one of the Onet buildings. Hey, treasure. <gasps> I think that's a good slingshot. I think it's one of the best slingshots, if I remember correctly. Wait. Yes. Monty, give the slingshot to yourself. I always expect this menu to start with the currently selected character, so I only I would only have to hit right once to get to Mario, but it doesn't. It always starts with Ness. Alright, Mario. Is the same? Oh, I guess the slingshot. Yeah, that's one of the universal weapons. That's not for Mario. 
I think I was thinking of a different gun with a similar sounding name. Well, I probably don't want to use a slingshot because it has worse accuracy. A pretty powerful weapon. Good description. I'll try. This is a hospital area. This is someone's... Bedroom in someone's house. Oh, mini... Many branching paths. Uh, where do, where do I want to start? Oh, treasure. Garrett key. Another key item that I probably won't end up needing. Alright, well let's start with this this area, because I think there is a full heal. Yeah, Brick Road, the dungeon developer. The first combination of human and dungeon in history. So, that's a free... Uh, so this counts as uh, sleeping in the hotel, unlike some of the other full heals. Which, when you actually sleep through the night, Mario has a chance of, of fixing broken items in his inventory. So, that turned into a, a defense spray, which is a consumable item that can increase your defense in a fight for one round. Thank you, Brick Road. So, if I had the pencil eraser, then I could erase this quote-unquote pencil-shaped iron statue and that would be a shortcut oh exploding tree is it afraid of me okay I'll take that so this is a different part of Onet <gasps> moonside this is my favorite area of regular earthbound it looks very cool. Ow! Ha! Ah. Not so victorious now, are you? Pretty crappy level there, for question mark. Heal up Mario. So Moonside is I'm not even going going to explain like what it is in Earthbound. Like it it is a different it is based on the town of Foreside, but it is different as you can see. Hey, right, uh, first bracelet I've ever found. Um Yeah, give that to Mario. No, not there I go again. I'm, I'm used to how Dragon Quest 7 handles it, because I've been playing that recently. And in that, when you give an item to someone, the window starts on whatever character is giving the item. So, so that's why that keeps happening. It is just a cheap bracelet, but it, it is 5 points of defense, so I will take it. So in Moonside there are these characters you talk to, and they teleport you around the map. It's not it's not the full four side map, it is it is smaller. And aid. I think that's a one time heal item. I'm gonna to toss that. Zambies. 
I'm a zombie. Can we talk it out? I don't, I don't think we can talk it out. Let's see if the zombies like fire. And let's see if the zombies like thunder. I have no idea what that, what that attack is. It does something very mysterious. I've never seen it actually do anything. It might just be a, a waste of turn attack. Yeah, fire was... Eh. Somewhat effective. Okay, they are very strong against ice. Nice. Ooh, offense and defense. Got a nice boost there. Also, nice point boost. Alright, let's cure question marks cold. Thank you. Let's get this treasure. Boiled egg. No thanks. I've had enough eggs for one, one earthbound run. I think there's one more treasure I can get over here. Ah! Oh. m monsters Chaotic spook. Hmm. Uh, let's have everyone attack the thrilled zombie and use a freeze attack on the ghost. Maybe it's more effective. Oh, it was more effective, but they have a lot of hit points. Luckily, I have a lot of damage. It's nice to have a run where... where question mark has a lot of hit points. Because what with not being able to equip defensive items, uh, it's good for that character to be somewhat of a tank. Yeah, here's that treasure. Molokea soup. Consumable healing item. Alright, that's the way I came. So if I want to backtrack, go through the hospital. Oh, such slow down. I think this is a shop? As soon as I take care of the weevils and the pretty it's pretty dead. Well let's let's make it more dead. Oh no. That's not good. Hmm. Well, question mark is more likely to go first, but if I wait, then they will probably die of the poison. And let's see if Ness can get a life up off before that happens. Um, let's freeze the pretty dead dog, or try to, and have Mario attack the unsullied, unsullied weevil, and question mark... I mean, it, if he survives, then he can he can get a free spell off. No. Oh no. Well, he still got the the spell off before he collapsed. Oh, that sucks. And then the life up spell doesn't retarget if if the character has died. Well, that's a bummer. Oh, Silas or Beta. I don't think I've even had a chance to use Alpha yet. Well, 
And pretty mediocre level for Monty. Okay, well, uh, I'm going to call it here. Tune in tomorrow and find out what is in this store. Hopefully I can buy something to bring Mario and question mark back to life. Crossing my fingers. Goodbye.